Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Summer days, which for me means a lot of bubble tea season. This original drink is from Taiwan, made with sweetened tea milk, characteristic chewy tapioca, also known as boba. when you purchase out there can get pricey and contain too much sugar. The good thing is that you can make them from scratch at home. Wanna learn how to make bubble tea? Well, let's go! To create tapioca you need just few ingredients. You will need tapioca flour which is also known as tapioca starch. Bring to a boil water with brown sugar. Stir and lower the heat when it starts boiling. We'll start by adding small amount of tapioca flour. Cook for less than a minute. You will notice that liquid will slowly start thicken. Remove from heat. Add remaining flour and start quickly mixing until you form a bowl of the dough, just like that. Transfer to a flat surface and start kneading until dough becomes smooth and flexible. If it's sticky to a surface, you can always sprinkle more with tapioca flour. This looks perfect. Divide the dough into four pieces. Make sure to cover to prevent from drying. Prepare in the separate bowl three tablespoon tapioca flour. This way you prevent them from sticking together. Next, you will roll with your palm forming thin sticks. Cut them into small pieces. Try to make them as even in size as possible. And they should be small enough to pass through your straw. Roll each piece in between your palms to create round shape. Time to time I like to use very small drop of water on my hands, this way it's easier to form the bowl. You will drop the pearls straight to flour. Tapioca balls to remove any excess of flour. Add the tapioca pearls to the boiling water and let it cook for 15 minutes. Transfer to a cold water, they might slightly shrink. You can as well add some ice. In a saucepan, bring to a boil water with sugar. Transfer to a sugar syrup tapioca and cook on low heat. You will cook until sugar syrup starts thicken. This way it prevents them from sticking together. To create Thai tea, I'm using Solong tea with chai. You can add any flavor you like, jasmine, green tea or even fruity flavors. For some spices, I'm adding star anise and just brew the tea for half an hour or until it's completely cold. Transfer your ready tapioca pearls and cover. Let it cool. Some people, when they create tapioca pearls, they add a food coloring or dark cocoa to create basically this dark shade of pearls. Let me show you a few of my favorite flavors of bubble tea. We'll start with Thai tea first. Place your tapioca pearls with ice. Add cool down tea. 
For these beautiful colors, we'll add evaporated milk and for sweetness, condensed milk. Next, I'm using a little bit of condensed milk for sweetness. You can substitute with honey and you can add your favorite milk like almond, coconut, vanilla or even skim milk. Can't forget about green tea. Add your favorite milk and green tea, which is diluted powder with water. Last one, raspberry mousse. Just blend raspberries with water and sift to have smooth consistency. Add coconut milk and for some sweetness, condensed milk or honey. And there you have four different flavors, very different and so delicious. Like I mentioned, bubble tea comes in many flavors of tea. Fruity and very popular taro, which is a root of vegetable used in Asian dishes. But now, I'll stick with this four. I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye!